Hey guys, so I'm making this little quick update video because not too long ago I was working on making Rayman climb and stuff like that and I discovered a pretty serious bug. So it turns out my movement code isn't as frame independent as I thought it was. Uh, if you remember in the second devlog video I showed this line of code over here and well while the maximum movement speed is frame independent this line over here works. This one above it doesn't exactly. Let me show you so you can see for yourself. So here in the output log, uh, every frame I'm logging my current run velocity. And I'll run forward now, okay? And now let's count how many frames it took me to reach maximum speed. So here I'm at zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It took eight frames at 60 frames per second. Now, Let's set the frame to 30 and I'll do the same thing. And now if we look at the output log, we also have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 frames. So this is incorrect because since it takes the same amount of frames to accelerate to the max speed, no matter at what frame rate I'm playing, then that means that at 60 frames, I reach the max speed twice as fast than at 30 frames per second. The way to fix this is pretty easy. All I did was just multiply this by another delta seconds. Okay, let's do this same thing again now. I'm playing at 30 frames per second now. So it took 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 frames again. So now I'm playing at 60 frames per second and if this is indeed working, my acceleration should take 16 frames. Okay, so counting these frames, it took 15 frames, so around twice as much. All right, that's pretty much all I wanted to say. I just thought that that was a pretty important correction to make in case anyone wanted to try to make something a little similar to what I'm doing here. Bye-bye.